Right. That's the goal for us to be a digital first publication. Um, Tamara Zeller's that. book, and I am an associate professor in the Department of Mass Media. I uh, am the Multimedia Journalism Coordinator, and I teach a variety of journalism courses, uh, including uh, Basic News, uh, which is the introductory writing course, um, and the Capstone course, uh, Multimedia Journalism. But I also teach MC304, which is Diversity in Communication, and MC401, which is probably my favorite course in Communication Law. I have the greatest job in the world. And that's because I love journalism. I love every aspect of journalism. And I get to talk about that with people who claim to love it as much as I do. So being able to train journalists is really exciting because it's never the same job. It's never the same um, even assignment. You know, every assignment is different. Every lecture is different because I try to incorporate as much currency in terms of topics as possible. So there have been times when news was breaking minutes before I went to a classroom and I was able to take that experience or that opportunity into the classroom to talk about it with my students. Um, so the changing nature of news and the um, ability to talk about something you love every day is really fulfilling. I love working with the student who will stretch. So for me, it's not about the student who comes in with the skill sets already. I can take a student who doesn't know anything about journalism, but has the drive and will try everything that's thrown at them and, and, and benefit from that and grow from it. That's the student I love to teach. Because some people are natural writers. Uh, and, but if they won't stretch themselves, they like sitting in that pocket, then that student's never going to get better. But the student who maybe is not as natural a writer, but who really wants to be a great writer, that's the student who is hungry. And they're going to take every aspect of this experience that we offer and learn from it and, and grow from it. And that's the person who is really, really going to excel and, be, and really make me happy to work with them every day. Well, you know what my hobby is not? Watching the news. Yeah, you know, and it's interesting because my husband loves to watch the news and it's almost an argument <laughs> sometimes because I come home and the last thing I want to do is turn on a news channel. I want to go and sit on my porch and listen to nature around me. I want to tinker in my, um, uh, what's it called? Uh, <laughs> uh, herb garden. I want to tinker in my herb garden and one thing I love to do is read non-fiction, uh, not, I'm sorry, read fictional new, uh, books, especially romance novels. I'm a romantic at heart, and so sitting around reading two or three books a week is absolutely something that I do all the time. I had to actually buy me a Kindle account because I was reading so much, so for $10 I can read all the books I want. And that's only because I'm too lazy to go to the library <laughs> and check out books. So I pay for the opportunity to do so. So playing around reading, playing, listening and playing in nature, digging in my herb garden. That's it.